Hey everyone, Mr. Brian and M1911 here. And in this review, I'm going to be doing something a little bit I haven't done before yet. Um, this one here is going to be on a meal combat individual ration, ham sliced, cooked with juices, B3 unit. Um, out of New Orleans, Louisiana. Alright. Go ahead and open up the box here. Here we have our accessory packet. Okay, I'm going to zoom out a little bit here. Come on. There we go. There we go. Hopefully the camera works properly for me here. Um, this one here, I can't remember if it's from 1980 or from 1977 because I picked up a couple of uh, MCIs, both from 1977 and 1980. So hopefully I can figure out which one this one is. Um, here's your little, of course, your little spoon. All right. Here we have our peanut butter. All right. Can is still in really good shape. And there's no real leakage. There's no rust. So there's that one is really good. Here we have our B3 unit. So we have crackers and candy. Okay, again, look at this here. They're really nice. No rust. Um, so, and there's no holes in the can. Um, and of course, the can is not uh, bowing out. Can't say for the rest of the stuff. All right, let's see here. Ah, yes. Now, this one here, unfortunately, yes, it got destroyed. So, there's a little hole down here where the fruit cocktail actually um, came out, but. I don't know if you can hear it as I'm shaking it up. It's still um, still liquidy. Okay. And then the last thing here we have is, of course, our ham sliced um, cooked with juices. So it has bowed out just a little bit. Um, so hopefully, <laughs> uh, well, I shouldn't say hopefully, it's probably got botulism in it. So I may go ahead and open it. If it spews, then I really know it's got botulism in it. But I'm going to go ahead and try to open it and see what uh, it looks like today. Okay, I'm definitely going to go ahead and open this just to see what it is all right so of course we have here our p38 um, can opener takes a little bit of time but it'll come out I don't smell anything horrible right now. If I do, I'll just take it outside and throw it in the outside garbage can. But there's nothing really horrible smelling yet. And Ramon's over there playing with a something there. Oh, he's eating the cat grass. And here comes Lucky. Now this is the first C ration or MCI that I've ever opened. Let's go ahead and pull the spoon out. Let's see what this looks actually looks like. 
Oh, yes. Look at that. That is your fruit cocktail. I don't know if you can see that. Ooh, wow. That thing has got... Oh, yeah. Um, let's go ahead. Yeah, look at that. That looks like it's been demonized. Ooh, wow. <laughs> Um, yeah, that thing definitely did not survive. Let's go ahead and see what happens here when we, oh, yep, definitely. We had a little vacuum, or, well, not vacuum, but we had air come out. So definitely this one has more than likely some form of botulism in it. But we're going to go ahead and open it anyway. I am in no way going to touch this. Okay. I mean, most people, you know, doing videos on this, they would speed up the camera to, you know, get through the, uh, the tiring part of opening this thing. But where's the fun in that? There we go, right there. Didn't take that long. <laughs> and uh, yeah. Ooh, look at that. Yeah. I don't know. You know what? <laughs> it's still, oh, look at that milky stuff come out of there. It's still actually looks pretty good um, I don't know what that middle piece there was but um, yeah little pork slices um, <coughs> you know it doesn't smell bad uh, oh now it does oh yeah oh wait a minute oh yeah now the smell is really getting to me Okay, let's go ahead and open up the B3 unit. Yeah, when I throw this out, I'm taking it directly out the, the back door. <laughs> I'm not throwing it in the garbage can in here. I can smell it already. All right. But this is how you would do it, you know, back in Vietnam, Korea, World War II. All right, so here's our B3 unit. Okay, so our crackers. So you put our crackers, of course, with the ham. Oh, you can smell how the chocolate got onto the crackers. Um, and then we have two little discs here, which is basically our, what is it, candy chocolate disc. Let's go ahead and open one of these up here. See what it looks like here. Almost kind of reminds me of those little candies that you got that were like the silver dollars, or gold dollars, or whatever when you were a kid. Damn, that still smells good. I ain't lying. Ooh. I'm almost tempted. Uh-oh. I gotta close that lid there before Lucky comes over and sniffs this here. Okay. That chocolate smells really good. But I don't know if I want to try it. Ah, screw it. Let's do it.
Okay. Let's say we did not. Oh, wow. Um, yeah. <sighs> yeah, that... It may smell great, but... Whoo! Wow! It, to tell you the truth, it tasted better than the gum of that one high altitude ration I did in that video. Oh! All right, let's open up the peanut butter here. See what the peanut butter looks like and smells like. Huh. I don't know if I want to even taste it, but um, it looks all right from opening it up right now. Oh. Okay. Oh, smells like peanut butter. Looks like peanut butter. I need my spoon here to. Looks and smells like peanut butter. Look at that. It does not look bad. And it tastes like peanut butter. Wow. That's good. That's actually good. Um, the peanut butter is probably the only thing in here that survived. Holy cow. I'm not trying that. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm not that brave. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at the accessory packet. Well, there's our toilet paper. Or napkins, whatever you choose to call it. And there's our cream substitute. All horribly messed up. And chiclets gum in the old box. Here we have sugar, salt, and this is more than likely coffee. Yep, coffee instant type one. So, you know what? Just for hoots and hollers, let's see how the coffee came out. We're not going to mix it up into anything, but let's see how the coffee survived. You know what? That looks really good. Yep. That looks like real good coffee. And it smells good, too. It smells all right. Let's look at the creamer. And the creamer, of course, looks really... <laughs> yep, there's your creamer. How the sugar turn out? Oh, the sugar seems to be like well, sugar turned out okay, and salt, of course, salt lasts millions of years, and of course, there's that. So, um, to tell you the truth, I didn't find anything that would probably have a date on it. Unfortunately, I do believe this one is from 1980, um, but. Um, like I said, I, I have a couple of them that I found. A buddy of mine got a hold of a bunch of them. He had some from 1977 and some from 1980. And I just, <clears throat> when I picked and chose from them, I forgot to, you know, look at the dates. So I do believe this one, however, though, is from 1980. So there you go. There's an MCI uh, Meal Combat Individual. Also known as Sea Rats B3 Unit Ham Sliced Cooked with Juices. Hope you enjoyed the video. I only taste tested a couple things, one or two things in here. Um, I was not about to go any further. Um, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please hit the like button, subscribe, leave a comment down below. Um, this is probably the worst fruit cocktail. I have ever seen. <laughs> this is Mr. M 1911 or Mr. Browning M 1911 out. 
and lucky out.